What's up, everybody? It's Funar from MultiplayerGamers.com. We're doing something a little bit different this time. This is Next Car Game. Uh, this is a pre-release game on Steam, and you're probably wondering why I'm sitting in a vast valley of white. Well, this is the test track, and this is the track that you get when you uh, when you get the pre-release game. And it doesn't look very interesting right now, but let me turn over here a second. This is the playground. So I'm going to spend a few minutes here and kind of showing off this game. This this game has lots of pro uh, promise, honestly. It's, it's, it's very cool. I've played it a few times already. Uh, I've played both uh, the test track here and also the uh, you know, the actual racing game and so forth. But this is kind of a technology demo. This is the world that the developers use to test the physics of the game and so forth. But I tell you what, it's fun to mess around in. And I, I've, I've, uh, I've got the AI players disabled right now, but man, listen, listen to that engine. So as you can see, there is just a ton of stuff here. There's this crazy spider thing over here. So what should we go do first? So let's just show off um, part of the physics here. We're going to jump into this jet engine looking thing. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that, that looks like that hurts. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know if we're going to get out of here. <laughs> so <laughs> let me zoom out of the camera here. So th that's what's left of my car. <laughs> So it's dynamic damage, which is pretty cool. Um, I'll go ahead and reset my vehicle here. There we go. Um, and there's only one car in the game, and that's this one, right? At least right now. I mean, this is pre-release, so you know what do you expect. Um, but like I said, the game has just tremendous amounts of promise. So let's let's hit some of these other ramps here, and maybe the the sphere of doom to that left there. Here. This one's my favorite right here, actually. Let's go up the big tall one. Oh, I don't run into stuff first. Let me re reset. We're gonna go up the big tall ramp right here. If I can center the car. There we go. Up, up. How far can we go? change views a little bit, watch the fall. So they've, they've definitely... Oh. Yeah, there's no surviving that if... Uh, <laughs> if, that was a, if that was real. We'll reset again. Where are we now? Oh, oh we're on top of the spikes. So, I mean, I mean, this is not the game. This is, this is the tech demo. Um... Again, this is just testing out the technology of the game, and and we'll have another video here of the actual racing, but I just thought, I found this map pretty cool, um, and it's fun to just mess around on, honestly, and you get this. Um, right now, if you get the game on Steam, uh, you'll actually get this map, too. Funny thing is, even though the car is, like, basically trashed, I can still sort of drive it around. <laughs> So, like, if I want to hit this uh, pointed ramp here. The the cool thing about the environment in the game, too, is everything, at least as far as I could tell so far, everything is destructible. So, like, these stacked up, they almost look like construction trailers. You know, if I just clip the corner of this, you know, I mean, it's it's destructible. You can see the ones above it toppled down, and that uh, the very top one kind of broken, broken a third right there. So I'm like everything uses that kind of, uh, you know, that that kind of damage system. So like these here, if I just tap it, you know, it's fine. Kind of broke one of them, but the rest of them toppled over. Now if I hit these things with, you know, basically the full speed here, it's going to be an entirely different story. 
just, you know, destroyed it. If I change the view of the camera and take a look at the car, I mean, you can see that, you know, the front end is all twisted and messed up. That is not, uh, you know, a, a model. That's, that's actual dynamic damage to the vehicle. And, you know, since I am playing in the test world, I can repair just with a hit and a key on the keyboard. The physics in the game for racing and the, and the vehicle uh, movement, it, it's, it just feels really solid. They've definitely spent a lot of time uh, on working on the physics of the game and, and getting it really um, as realistic as possible in you know this incredibly unrealistic world. But um, the actual racing part of the game is very, very realistic controls. Going here into the pit of doom. And this might get a little crazy, so we'll change cameras. Just see just the car get trashed. Again, this is all using the physics engine in the game. And, and it does use the, the PhysX uh, <laughs> library from NVIDIA as well. Yeah, check that out. I mean, there's just nothing left of the car. It's basically a tin can. Reset again. We'll just drive into the sphere here real quick. The lighting, beautiful again, dynamic lighting. As expected in you know any game these days. Oh yeah, up and over. Oh, clip something. Not sure what I clipped there. I think I got rid of my front wheel though. Let's see, where else should we go here? We'll uh, take a look over here. What is this? Oh, this is the big jump, and I just fell into the pit. We'll reset. So here, we'll go down the pit here. Nope, that is not where I went to go. <laughs> what I meant to do is go up here. Onto the ski jump. Very cool. The AI again, you know, it's a pre-release game. Um, the AI is pretty good in the race mode. Again, that'll be another video. Um, This is actually the, the, the thing they uh, talk about the most about this demo world is the cannon. If I pull into here. Oh yeah, off we go. Flip into the boxes. <laughs> you, could, you could mess around on here, you know, for... At least I could. I could mess around on this in this little test world for just for a while. And it's just so much fun. Like I said, you can turn the AI on too and have other cars um, drive around here. I, just for the purposes of this video, I, I turned that off. So yeah, nice skid. Again, you know, this is, I think it's simulated concrete uh, in this world, even though it's a big white plane. We'll hit the loop-de-loop -loop real quick here. Oh, not, oh, I stayed on. There we go. Oh, and I lost a front wheel. Um, no, I have no steering. <laughs> Is there one front wheel or both? And we'll 
we'll just finish the car off in the crusher here. Come on. There we go. We'll just finish it off. Shred it up a little bit. <laughs> Again, dynamic damage system. Um, you know, it's just sh shredding the car. Bits and pieces fly everywhere. Where should we go now? Let's, let's hit a basket. And then we'll get to pretty close to closing the video out here. And then we'll, you know, if I can hit the ramp, we'd be all set. Try that one more time. I gotta at least make a basket before I close this out. And you're you're not stuck to third person view. Um, here we go. Try this again. Come on, baby. What do we got? Five. Oh, no, four? No, missed it again. <laughs> and you do it, at least in, uh, in this mode, you do have weapons. So, like, you can see here I'm shooting, you know, boxes. Um, okay. Again, there's no AI, so... Presumably there's other weapons in the game. I haven't seen that part of it. Um, this is just, again, the tech demo, so I'm just shooting what looks like random boxes. But it's a good, it's a good uh, um, test of the, of the physics in the game. I mean, check this out. Look at that, each can, separate object, interacting separately with the environment and what I'm doing to it. It's just cool stuff. This is another shredder. They say we just end this vehicle right now. Yeah, that pretty much is the end of that car. And I can shoot some more boxes. <laughs> so we'll be playing more of this, uh, more of this game, you know, more of the racing part of the game. There's also a demolition derby mode, which is, which is a lot of fun. Um, dirt track racing, tarmac racing. It's definitely a game to watch. This, this is uh, this is next car game uh, available on Steam right now. Um, it is uh, developed by Bugbear Entertainment, and uh, yeah, definitely check it out. Uh, we'll be doing a couple more videos on this one, um, showing off some more of the stuff you can do with it, and uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. If you have enjoyed the video, click on that like button. Um, also, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one and more games. We have uh, new videos every day at 6 p.m. Eastern Time. Also, take a visit to our community at MultiplayerGamers.com. Until next time, this is Funar from MultiplayerGamers.com. Thanks for joining.